In today's date, if we talk about storage drive performance, then no doubt that M.2 and VMI SSDs have faster read-write speeds than the 2.5 inch SATA SSDs. But remember they are also costlier. So if you have a good budget, then NVMe M.2 SSDs are best option in the market. But if you are tight on your budget and still don't want to compromise on your PC's boot speed and read-write performance, then 2.5 inch SATA SSDs are still the best option. You will find lot of options in this category in the market. Today I am going to give a quick overview of these two 2.5 inch SATA SSDs. The first one is from Adata. It's the Ultimate SU800 256GB and the second one is from Crucial MX500 250GB. You must be wondering why I selected this 250GB range. But before coming to that, let me quickly tell you where these storage drives are best utilized. Suppose you want to have a secondary boot OS along with your primary windows such as Linux or any other operating system in your PC or if you are looking for any secondary disk just for taking your primary systems backup full system recovery backup or if you are looking for any secondary disk for taking a mass storage with proper read write speed then I think you can go for this 2.5 inch SSDs and of course as per your requirement choose the best capacity you require for me I selected 250 because I am going to use this one of these as a secondary boot OS I will be installing Linux in future also the other disk I will be utilizing for creating a primary system image backup now I will quickly go through the features of both of these SSDs. Both these SSDs are priced somewhere around 3000 rupees. I bought these online from Amazon. These are powered with 3D NAND technology and comes with capacities ranging from 128GB till 2TB. If you check the features, you will get almost the same features at low price as compared to other brands like WD Blue, Black or the Samsung Evo series. The Adata's Ultimate SU800 has a read write speed of 560 and 520 Mbps whereas the crucial MX500 has a sequential read writes of up to 560 and 510 Mbps respectively. So both are almost similar in their speed. The crucial MX500 also comes with this bracket which will be helpful if you are installing this SSD in your laptop. You also have a Crucial's manual guide for quick and easy installation. It features an integrated power loss immunity that preserves all your saved work if the power is cut unexpectedly. The 256-bit hardware-based encryption keeps the data safe and secure from hackers. This Crucial comes with a 5 years limited warranty. So let me first install these SSDs in my PC. So as you can see both the SSDs are detected in my BIOS. Now I will be logging into Windows and quickly check out their read write speeds. But before that I first need to initialize the disks 
and format them as required. First I am going to do the quick test on ADATA's ACU 800 SSD. So let us check what's the read write speed actually. So it seems the sequential read write speeds are same what they are claiming. Now I will do the same test on the Crucial MX500. Here also the result seems ok. So that's all friends, keep watching this channel. See you all in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.